Couch Conversations, you know what it is. Brought to you by Dr. Pepper, Trevor Scales, Gary Streisky. And I always love when we get to have running backs on the show. Like, I just have a personal affinity, having played the position myself. And joining us today is a man who was very efficient with the carries today. Eight carries, 73 yards, three trips to the crib. That is one Michael Carter from UNC, the Tar Heels, representing on Senior Day. We appreciate you taking the time joining us here on the wrap-up, Michael. And uh, we'll start this thing off right because, again, played a little running back myself. And I understand just what it's like to be a part of a committee back there. How many times have you and Javante Williams played rock, paper, scissors, but who gets to go into the end zone at the end of a drive? <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, man. We, <laughs> we, don't, we don't fight over it, honestly. I know that if we if I break off a long run and I get down to the one, Javante coming in <laughs> and vice versa. So yeah. it's all about finishing the run. <laughs> right. So, like, y'all got to give plenty plenty grief to each other about, look, you better finish the drill because I'm coming in and sniping that six if you don't. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> I got to come take it seriously. Vice versa. You had a hell of a performance on your senior night after the game. You said it was overwhelming. It was weird for so many different reasons. Can you just sort of encapsulate what today actually was and meant for you? Definitely. I, I don't think that it really hit me about, you know, it being senior day and it's the last time I'm actually going to be on the field at Keenan Stadium until probably a couple of hours ago. I think it was it, it really was a weird experience because of, of COVID and things like that. But overall, I'm grateful for the experience and just to have the opportunity to even be here for the last four years. So yeah, it was man. good. It was fun. I imagine that. And, and speaking of a fun run, like, Honestly, this entire season for the Tar Heels has been like a hell of a run for y'all. Like, to do the things that y'all have done to make the run spe uh, specifically at the beginning of the season that y'all have done as an offense, what's that been like for you? Yeah, it's been, it's been fun. I saw a stat today. I think we had I think we've had six games in a row of over 500 yards. And I, just, I think that's, like, <laughs> unbelievable. You don't see that a lot. So it's just a blessing to be a part of that. Okay. So and to be – yeah, go ahead. Go no, ahead. no, no, please. Go ahead. No, I was just saying it's the blessing because, you know, when I got here, the team was, you know, they were back and forth between good and bad seasons. But my first two years, we just weren't good. And not that we wasn't good, we was talented, but we just wasn't finishing games. So now, you know, the last two seasons, we've been able to put together some wins and have some success. It's just been a complete 180. I'm just happy to be a part of it. No, that's a blessing for real. Uh, but I'm trying to stoke the flames a little bit more within the locker room. <laughs> uh, because look, the run game, <laughs> run game is solid. I mentioned you and Javante. But Sam Howell was making a Heisman campaign towards the start of the season. What's that like as far as just being able to click on all cylinders every single Saturday? You don't care what the defense throws at you. Y'all know you're going to get your numbers up. Honestly, it's so crazy because we got, of course, you know, we got me and Javante and then we got some really good offensive linemen and we got a, the best quarterback in the nation and Sam Howe. And we got some demons on the outside at receiver, whoever it is, you know, our, our first group, second group, it don't matter. I mean, just to know that we, we can put numbers up on anybody whenever we feel like it. It just is awesome. It's a cool feeling. Michael, enough football talk. The regular people who didn't play D1 ball like myself and the majority of our audience watching want to know, what is it like to be a Jordan athlete playing at UNC? And I got to imagine the equipment room maybe stays unlocked. I mean, is it just a free-for-all? Like, what's it like? Hoodies. For example, did you get the University Nines today that nobody got? Man, uh, I feel like. I feel like y'all might be a little overestimating just a little bit. <laughs> but I, I think it's like a really cool experience just being a Jordan team, one of like four maybe. Um, I know that kid from BYU wears the Jordan headband, but he ain't got the all Jordan, gear. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Jordan. Just but, imagine though. But, yeah, but I think I think I think we are gonna get the nines. That's just if I had to roll the dice, I think we're going to get them. That's so not, we'll see. That's not a bad way to kind of just tee things up. Me and Gary <laughs> sitting over here, we ain't got no choice. <laughs> I tried. I caught an L. But that's I took <laughs> plenty of L's this morning. <laughs> I tried every website just out there, Michael. So, so many. It was on the sneakers app? Yeah. Yes. We took an L, oh, bro. You know like, that, hey, you know you're not going oh, that. How about this? He was just like, hey, uh, y'all go to the sneakers app? I don't do that. <laughs> I, I go to the equipment room. <laughs> Anytime I go on the sneakers, I, I already know I'm not going to win. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's part of the game. Look, uh, uh, real quick, as far as just uh, the videos that y'all are able to put out, courtesy of the gear that you're getting, who is shooting these? And, like, how can <laughs> I find a videographer to get me that top-level production to just follow me around? Uh, 
Yeah, Matt, Matthew Federick do uh, uh, videos and and Mike Jones do the pictures. And from the time I came here to the time I'm leaving, our, our media team took a 180. Like, they are beasts. Like, they, they make everything look good. Every picture they send you, you're going to want to post it. So I just, you got to kind of calm down with the post. You don't want to have too many. So, but yeah, Matthew Federer do the video. So he, he really good. So. Hey, man, shout out to Matthew then. We appreciate the time, Michael. Congrats on <laughs> the heck of a career that you've had at the UNC Tar Heel program. And uh, best of luck in your future endeavors, man. Appreciate y'all, man. Appreciate y'all. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.